Construction on the museum began on Tuesday, when the cornerstone was laid. The land that the building will stand on used to be part of the sea before a reclamation project allowed the land to be used for construction. The museum is designed to house both new and old maritime items with a focus on celebrating the historical achievements of Chinese naval exploration throughout history. The building's design features a large roof with undulating skylights. The skylights could be seen as metaphorically representing fish leaping from the water or ships swaying in a boatyard. The museum will look like an extension of the sea on land. It includes a marine park and a storage area. The museum already has a collection of over 42,000 antiques that are ready for display. Construction is scheduled to be completed around the end of 2016, with the museum set to open the following year.